Uh, now, one story that caught my eye recently uh, concerned this judge from Delaware, USA, and he punished this convicted sex offender by actually making the guy wear a T-shirt that said sex offender, like this one here. That's right, and apparently his friends, whenever they're with him, are now legally obliged to wear this T-shirt. <laughs> I'm with sex offender. Yeah, I mean, the question, though, is... You know, do T-shirts really work as a punishment? I mean, do they really alert local people to your deviance? Well, to find out, we sent Charles Firth into the heart of Delaware, USA with a new range of punishment T-shirts. G'day. Do you know where the nearest children's playground is? <laughs> children's playground. Excuse me, do you have the time? Did they make you wear that shirt? Oh, this, oh no, this is just my flatmates. Uh, this is just my flatmates. Are you sure? Because yeah. I know they make people wear those shirts. You want some help with your bags? <laughs> no, can I help you with your bags? No. Give me back to yours. I'm not so sure, dude. You sure? I, I can yes, help you out. Yeah? Yeah, but look at your shirt. Are you the owner of this? Does that, does that go back to the depot? Depot? Yeah. What do you mean, back to the depot? Yeah, back to the depot. Okay, thanks. Can I get a doppio espresso with a twist of lemon, please? With a twist of lemon? How much for an eight ball? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, this? No, no, these are just my friends. This, no, I'm no, not a crack deal. Oh, just uh, hang around. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Hello. Do you need a babysitter? Uh, no, she doesn't here. Never mind. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.